A little while ago, Pivothead sent me this Wi-Fi drive, and I've been waiting to uh, unbox it so that you guys can see it, and uh, I haven't used it yet. I wanted to show you guys the first time that I ever used it, so let's do it. Mm -hmm. You, you, you one-handed opening of stuff. There we go. There it is. Pull out this here air pivot head. All right, I can't do it. Come on. All right. There it is. All right. Oh, it's pretty intense looking. I'm assuming that this thing's rechargeable through the USB because I just turned it right on. And look at that. It works. It says to access the network here, air pivot head. Oh, I'm connected. Now it says to go into my browser and type in democracy into, no, 10 dot 10 dot one dot one. Go. Sorry, I wasn't showing you guys that. Now it says that I can go to the Pivot Head app. Let's see what it says. Huh. That works. Let's try filming some stuff on the Pivot Head glasses and downloading it to this. See what it looks like. I'm just recording down here. I took like 15 pictures with the Pivot Heads. And now I'm just recording my iPhone and the Air Pivot Head through the Pivot Heads. Yay, let's see what it does now. Go into the application. And then the cool thing was when I turned on the glasses while they're plugged in. It turned it on, and then the last time that I did this, it was near immediate that they showed up here. There they go. That's pretty sweet. So now I've got photos. These are all of the photos that I just took. This is how the, uh, the videos do. You can take this, if I do this, edit, and do this, and then I say, I can save it to my library, I can move it somewhere, I can rename it, or I can delete it, or I can download it. Fun fact, this can be used as a wired card reader when it's not turned on. Like if I just plug the USB in here and into the computer, this will be an SD card reader. I can take this video right here, which is the one that we recorded. Now if I say, take this guy and save it to the library, I don't know how fast it does it. It says that it's done, been saved in my library. It's still on the camera here, but I can delete it if I want to. Say edit, this guy, uh, delete you. Off the old camera -ruski. there it goes. It's all gone, piece of cake. So, now we go to my photos and camera roll. And look, there it is. And now if I wanted to, if I had iMovie. I could put that up on the internet, or I could edit it in, uh, you know, any of this stuff here, or uh, actually any of these guys here. What do I use? I have, I have Real Director. Here's the thing that's interesting about this whole thing. All of the photos and videos that I'm taking on this camera, I can stick in here and transfer them to my phone and then edit them on my phone and upload them to YouTube uh, on the run. That sounds awesome to me. Here's the other thing that's interesting. This seems to be charging my pivot heads. Ah, sneaky sneaky. All in all, I give it the thumbs up. Jen went with my mom to go paint some Christmas decorations, but she needs a, a old shirt so she doesn't get paint all over herself. So I'm gonna bring it to her, but I did put the keys to the car in her purse so because I thought she was gonna take the car. She's not. My mom drove her. Now I don't think I have keys to any car. To get to her. Here's the finished one. I'm making the um, the gifts, and then <laughs> this is how it starts. Anybody else want a cookie right now? A cookie? Mm, sure. <laughs> Looking pretty good. So I painted my little balls white, and then I gave it a second coat. It's looking. I don't know if it's gonna turn out very good. I've got my my green present there, and now this is this way. Just paint the red lines. And it's gonna look like that one. Round one of stripe painting. 
doesn't look so bad. I forgot to show you guys how far I came. This is my, my plaid gift. I got my stripes and my green. I need one more coat of green though. Almost done. Oh, it's a bug. Is it a bug or is it a I think it's a bug, yeah. You want to eat it? It's protein. Yeah. Not too shabby. Here's the end product. Or, well, no, we're not quite done actually. You're just sitting there looking cute. You are doing something. I'm finally home. <laughs> That was so much fun. We actually, um, we did not finish our little presents that we, that's what it was. I don't know if you could tell, but it was like three presents in a row. And basically the whole thing was you're supposed to put like a bow and then your name on it and put it on your front door or wherever you put your Christmas decorations. We were there for five hours and we didn't finish it. So it was definitely intricate and involved, but it was um, so cute. Like it's gonna be adorable. And I'm thinking, um, that I will put it on the front door like a like a wreath almost and I wish I could have showed you the woman's house because her house was so Nice like every single room was painted some like really funky color or she had like this mural in her in her kitchen of like a, You know the um, like fat chefs she was saying that because um, Christmas is coming It's not even Thanksgiving yet, but everybody's all like ready for Christmas. It's nuts um, She has 13 Christmas trees that she puts up in her house so I was like amazed by that. We didn't even have a Christmas tree last year. We didn't finish, so she's gonna actually, um, we're, we're gonna have to finish it on Tuesday, another day. So I will show you the finished product just as soon as I am done. I worked really hard on it. <laughs> Maybe I'll do something like that in the future. It was just kind of like wood cutting. I don't know how to cut wood, but I, I could learn. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.